Hello students, today we will see domestic electric circuit or household electric circuit. We all know that electricity is produced at the power station and it is brought to the cities using overhead wire cables or underground wires. Okay, then this electricity that we get at home is having a potential difference of 220 volt. The electricity that we get at home is supplied by the uh, MSCB or the power companies. Okay, they are, there are many power companies which are public sector as well as some companies are in the private sector. So, we get electricity from the power station through the overhead cables, through the power stations and then we get the electricity at home using overhead wires or underground wires or underground cables. Now, the electricity that we get at home has a potential difference of 220 volt and those the two wires which which are which are connected to the pole and carried into the house are of two types. First wire is a live wire and the other wire is a neutral wire. Live wire has red insulation over it and has a potential difference of 220 volt and neutral wire has a potential difference of 0 volt and it is covered with the black insulation. So, the potential difference between live wire and a neutral wire is 220 volt. Now, there is one more wire which is also connected in the domestic electric circuit and that is earth wire. Earth wire is green in color. Earth wire is green in color. It has a green insulation over it. So, you can see here as we get the this live wire and neutral wire in the house through the cables, the live wire is connected to a fuse before entering into the electric meter. Now, this fuse can be used for many purposes to protect the electrical appliances all this or it also can be used in a times when we have to do the maintenance inside the house then we can stop the electric supply by removing that uh, fuse and then we can work inside the house and then again put the fuse and then we can use the electricity. So, fuse has many advantages. This fuse has many advantages. Then the live wire and neutral wire enters into the electric meter. Electric meter is 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 an instrument which is fit by the electricity uh, uh, providing companies like MSCB and this meter measures the number of units or number of units of energy that our house has consume in a month. So, electric measure, electric meter measures the unit of electricity that is consumed by the house. Then live wire and neutral wire enters into the distribution box and from the distribution box this live wire and the neutral wire they are sent to the different parts or different rooms in the house. Okay. So, after the wire comes out of the distribution box, there can be a fuse, you can put individual fuse for each room or you can put one common fuse for all rooms. Here we can see earth wire, live wire and neutral wire, they are carried to each and every room of the house and let us see the connection. This is a female switch having three female sockets. These are the three, this is a female socket having three switches, three female sockets. So, one wire is connected to the neutral and connected to the one socket. The red wire is connected to one and the earth wire is connected to this socket. So, in this way a connection is made. So, all the connections that are made in the house in household electric circuit are the parallel circuits. All the appliances are connected parallel in the domestic electric circuit. There are many advantages of connecting the appliances in the parallel circuit. That is one of the advantages that all the appliances will get same potential difference. At the same time, if any one appliance fails, all other appliances will not be affected, all other appliances will work normally. 
okay we will put another switch so a neutral wire is connected to one live wire is connected to one and the earth wire is connected to one so in this way many switches can be connected even you can connect a fan or a tv or many appliances using this type of circuit so domestic electric circuit in domestic electric circuit most of the appliances all the appliances they are connected in parallel there are in the domestic electric circuit there can be two types of connections there are separate connections carried out for high powered appliances like refrigerator air conditioner and there is another type of uh, uh, circuit which is carried which is carried for the low powered low powered electrical appliances thank you